Signs showing which Sydney beaches are protected by shark nets could be set up following recent attacks along the state's coast. The move will be considered after Seven News discovered the information is being kept secret from nervous swimmers. Sharks on the coastline, a full-time threat. Look at that! It's a great white! With part-time protection. Few people realise our beaches only have to be netted 13 days a month and finding out which days is next to impossible. We chased down one of Sydney's two shark net contractors. Can we ask you a couple of questions? No way. He claims authorities have gagged him. You're not allowed to talk to us? So Seven News decided to check for ourselves and audit on every net from Palm Beach to Maroubra with expert help from Coast Care's eco divers. We found most in good condition, others torn and tangled and some not there at all. Bronte, Avalon, Newport and DY all unprotected. Officials say they're regularly moved to break shark territorial behaviour. Knowing that, I probably wouldn't choose this beach to come to. Yeah, why do they shuffle them around? I mean, they don't know where the sharks are going to be at which time. 25 Sydney beaches are in the program, but you never know which ones have the nets. The other surprising thing about these shark nets is their size. Most are only 150 metres long. You might be able to see our crew working at the end of this one. But if we take the shot from the Seven News chopper, you can see it's not much coverage when the beach runs for over a kilometre. At Collaroy Narrabeen, five kilometres of beach and just two 150 metre nets. To think that the nets are there uh, as a barrier is just wrong. Still, the reality is no one has died on a Sydney beach since the program began. It can't be luck. 71 years is a long time to have a lot of luck. But the minister says he will consider a beach sign system showing if nets are in or out. Some form of publicity could be made around that. I think that'd be a great idea. And then you can make the choice of where you want to go. Chris Reason, 7 News.